Good morning, Nelika crew. What it do? Today we are going to be doing a cook with me. I am doing lemon pepper chicken. I'm also making potatoes and Brussels sprouts. So come along with me today as we get our cook on. Listen, before we get into all of that, let me just um tell y'all don't come for me today don't come for me today because i got my pajamas on i'm going to be recording like three different videos today it's going to be really really busy so i'm not interested in getting all cute and stuff no let's just get busy and get it done <laughs> cut chicken all ready to go it is cleaned and here are the ends And so here I am. The reason why I put aluminum foil is so that 
none of the skin would stick to the uh, pan because these glass pans can be hard to um, cook and soak when you have when you're cooking food like this that you know when the skin gets crispy and stuff like that it'll start sticking to it sticking to the bottom of it so to avoid from having to do so much work cleaning this pan I just put those in there so now what I'm going to do is just slice my potatoes pepper obey not lemon pepper garlic lemon pepper obey yes. lemon pepper obey chicken <laughs> i just cannot get it together all right so i am changing my um i'm not gonna saute anymore i'm no longer gonna saute the potatoes but what i am going to do is them in my cast iron pan and I'm going to cook them in the oven because I just want them to get golden so I just put a little bit of I base this with olive oil I'm going to season these and once I'm done seasoning them I'm going to dump them into the cast iron and I'm going to add the onion in and season the potatoes and I'm going to get it going that way all right, what I'll be using in the potatoes is a garlic powder, parsley flakes, a little bit of kicking chicken. I would like to have a little bit more, but I can only put a little bit of there because Kaylee does not like anything hot. Obey um, seasoning, I'm also going to put in there along with the onion. So let's get it going. And also, I am eyeballing this, so you'll have to do the same. Eyeball that shit, eyeball that shit. And I gotta open this kicking chicken.
also I put a little bit of garlic and herb flavored curry gold butter in just like three slices because this butter is flavored very nicely and I know that it'll be a great addition to this dish that I got from giant they are already cut into halves so that makes this dish a whole lot easier for me and I'm just gonna season this with salt and pepper that's it these cook really fast so I have to um, I usually put them on broil Just a bit of oil, olive oil on those, and I kind of move them around just because it cooks them a little bit better. You can taste that clean taste from the olive oil. The coat gives it a little bit more flavor, but only salt and pepper. We all know I love using the Himalayan pink salt. So, just gonna season. Just a little and a little. Gotta eyeball it. And we will see the outcome of this in a moment. How yummy this chicken turned out to be. Ooh, yes. This is how the potatoes turned out. Got nice and crispy edges. And they taste so good. I tasted one already. So good. So, there y'all have it. The potatoes are done. This is the aftermath of the Brussels sprouts. I'm not sure how long I kept them in there. Um, and like I said, I put them on broil. So you have to really pay close attention to them because they will burn fast. But this is the outcome. You and me will always be tired.